right guys, you catch me down at my undisclosed um, little lake, um, Friends Water. It's probably about an acre and a half, two acres in size, it's not very big, but it's got some right little gems in it. Um, some immaculate fish. I've been on and off this place for properly for the last six years. So um, I know the place at like the back of my hand, but I've been down here for ten years. But the last six years I've got properly into carp fishing. Um, I've had most of the fish out of here, but it's just a water where it's just nice to come for a winter bite um, if my other places are struggling. Um, it's going to be 35 acre um, syndicate near Boston. I'm struggling on that one. The last three sessions I've been on that, I've blanked. But I'm going to keep the bait going and hopefully it'll click on. Um, but, you know, fingers crossed for that one. So I've come down here for a quick bite. Um, I arrived last night about half past three, um, Friday the 7th, um, it's Saturday the 8th of the day, and um, the conditions were shit, basically. Um, all day yesterday, it's just been raining on and off, heavy rain, so all that's gone into the water, so I put a right chill on the place. But I came Thursday night to put some bait in ready, and um, the whole lake was frozen up. <coughs> um, there was literally a couple of holes behind the where behind the back of the islands where the wind where the wind is, um, and there was three, but you can't fish them. Um, so I was a bit disheartened about that. But with all the rain that we've had, it's actually thawed out. The temperatures, have, you know, the temperatures have kept up <laughs> above freezing. But all the rain we've had, um, plus the ice, there's a lot of cold water gone in the place, and it's gone up. It's late. It's risen about two inches, something like that. But um, I arrived here, I said half past three, pissing down rain, and uh, I saw a fish just swale on my left hand spot where I put some bait in um, on Sunday, um, last Sunday. So I was trying to get down Monday or Tuesday, which um, didn't work. I couldn't get because of work commitments and what have you. But um, I fuzzed the rod on all the spots that I baited up, the three spots spread over, you know three quarters of the lake so basically there's only um, a quarter and a little bit behind the island that I actually covered so hopefully you know I should be on them as I say it's only small so you can't be too far from them and uh, I've put the left one on the red spice and uh, and the middle and the right rod um, what's like situ between the islands they're on the project A um, and I've just put out 14 boilers, I mean, lucky number is 7, so 7 14. And uh, I spread them 14 boilers over the areas of Red Spice and Project A, 14 mils, um, what I've been using all season. And at half past nine, I was just wrapped up in bed, and my left hand rod went. Um, it did one bleep, and then a big drop back, and then the line was just slack. Picked the rod up, wound into it, and it was pretty much under my feet, you know, so it came a good 20 yards. Um, I played that, netted that, and uh, it was a 17 one call. So, you know, well shuffled. I don't really fish it much nowadays. I come down, I probably fish it three times a year, if that. Um, last time I fished it was 16 weeks ago, which was the beginning of August. I did a quick nine. So, you know, 16, 16 weeks away, I had a right result. So, you know, I bagged one. I ain't got a blank, so I've got a story to tell you guys. Um, so yeah, so I'll pucker, um, well chuffed, well pleased. Um, I'm confident of another take, you know, I'm here for another couple of hours, yeah. The conditions, it's clear skies, the odd cloud, it's been spitting a bit this morning, but, you know, the temperature's is hovering around the freezing mark, but um, the wind's changed from northeast. the wind was bloody biting northeast. Um, it's gone round to uh, a west, northwest. So, you know, the wind's changed round and hopefully it might just, uh, you know, steer them into moving a little bit, I don't know. But I did video the car last night for you, but like a plonker, buddy cut half the fish out, so the video was shit. So I've deleted that, so apologies, it would have been a nice little video just to show you the comment. But I've got a pe picture of it, so, um, you know, it's all good on that, you can see it. I think I'm praying for that big mirror. I'd love to catch that big mirror, especially in its winter conditions and its, its winter way. Like I say, there's a 
common in the long common and uh, I had him out last September at £30.15 and my mate Steve he came beginning of the year and had him out at 33 so I reckon it, he's probably hovering around 33 35 mark as well so you've probably got three thirties at the right time, three four thirties at the right time so it's a nice little place for a winter 30 if you can get it um, but you know it's just lovely to be out so I ain't been out in a week so I love it, I love being out so if I get a fish I'll video it and make sure it's better for you guys but other than that you know I've bagged one and uh just see me and just read up on my uh, blog what I write up about it so leave to it